child here. So as you low by loud, the interview has been completely dropped by Sony. A couple of weeks ago after being allegedly hacked by the North Korean government and perhaps Kim Jong-un himself because who knows? Who knows where he is? Perhaps he's the one hacking them personally. Because it's hard to believe that one of the most economically deprived country in the world can afford hackers to hack a top level high executive Hollywood company. It's shocking! The latest news about the situation is that any theater to feature the interview will potentially be facing an act of terror from the North Korea government. And I never knew that Hollywood was going to succumb to the act of terror because honestly, there's nothing to fear but fear itself. I'm actually very, very saddened by this whole situation. So guess what? I'm taking matters into my own hands. Peter Chow is going to buy the interview from Sony and release it on my YouTube channel. However, I cannot do it all on my own. As rich as you think that I am, I need your money to do it. I have an Indiegogo campaign and we are going to raise enough money so I can march right up to those Sony executives and go hey, you want to cower and succumb to the act of terror? That's fine. Since you're not doing anything with the interview anyway, give me that shit. I'm asking for $420,000 to buy the movie from Sony. And Chow Nation, this is where you come in. So without further ado, if you want to comment about anything related to this video, this campaign, what have you, you Use the hashtag save the interview and of course you can access the indiegogo campaign by going to bit.ly slash save the interview without further ado let's run it down all right boom i got it i got it up the title of the campaign is peter chow buys the interview from sony pictures north korea bullies sony into submission but nobody will stop peter chow from release of the movie give me and white man producer jason burkhardt the money so i buy movie the interview from Sony and release on YouTube channel. If Sony does not buy the movie, I will keep money and maybe consider gift to Seth Rogen in support his cause of smoking the 420 to relieve him of the stress from this awful situation. Jane Franco get laughing. Let's run down the perks. If you don't lay four dollar, this is a title. Four dollar only? You so cheap. My heart thank you oh so much to battle threat on terror. But come on, don't lay more, you cheap asshole. It is about principle, bitch. Forty-two dollar. Good. More than four dollar. My heart thank you eleven times the amount of time I thank anyone who just be cheap and donate four dollar. What's up, perk number one? No money. Four hundred and twenty dollars. Oh, you the big boy. Fat woman too in parentheses. One to tole big time? You so brave to take big stands on terrorist demand. You have bigger balls than Sony. Maybe digital copy. At my discretion, I change my mind anytime. If you pledge $4,200, the title is Are You the Rich Asian? Wow. Give you the shout out on my YouTube channel. Say, hey, motherfucker. You the best. And you are big rich Asian farm and have money to blow on the truck and expensive handbag but instead you give to me to buy movie that's great digital copy for sure warning shipping is a big portion of your pledged amount so i mean hey i don't i don't make the rules okay expenses if you pledge four hundred and twenty thousand dollars you must be set broken big money big prayer good job secret high level executive from sony that want the interview to see the light of day your reward is the pride either you are seth rogan desperate for us to see the movie you direct or you are representative of a north korean government wanting to help me buy movie get me to defect join your coalition and burn the movie but i say low low succumbing to terror peter chow does not cower peter chow does not touch the tail in between my legs. We will not stand for a chance for the North Korean government to do the lie 11 times a thousand on anybody. So to take a collective stance, we must form a group together and you must fund me so I can do this and take credit for it. And I have a message for Mr. King Kong Kim Jong. Stop drinking the haterade and start drinking the bubble tea. Chow outside, motherfucker. Bring it back.